today i'm going to tell you that how you can uh, import variables from one matlab file dot uh, m file uh, to another dot m file and by doing so you will be exporting the variables from one file into a dot txt file and from that txt file you will be importing the variables uh, to be used in the next m file for that purpose i have to made i have made two gui files on matlab i am now going to show you what are these the version which i am going to use is 2012 version now now i am going to open them for you first is test.m and second one is test2.m first i am going to open the first file and if i open it uh, from the gui mode you can see that open an existing file test and this one i have now selected i have written this static text here and a text box then static text and a text box and i have applied just a very simple formula if you just right click here and go to view callback now you can see here it is taking a, a value from the user the name of the first text box is edit1 and it is storing that value into a1 then a2 will going to be making the square of this value of a1 and storing in it a2 then the second box here this one which is text uh, which is edit2 is going to display the value of a2 set handles dot a2 string value numerical to string a2 a2 is going to display the value here and uh, let us just play it and check that i am now going to enter 10 and just click on push button and you can see 100 here so uh, if we go if we now see this file this coding save a2.txt a2 this is the name of the variable this one the value which you have to store in that variable and ascii you have to write this ascii otherwise it will not work so let us see whether it has made one a2 file text file yes this one you can see the output here 100 raised to power 2 means that this decimal will go to here the value is 100 now if you want to use the same value in another m file let me open another m file which is test 2 i'm going to open it in gui now you can see that this value if i run that it should pick the same value which it is it is doing now i'm going to show you the coding behind that go to callbacks I have just selected a function which I shouldn't have so this is the coding you can see load command is used to load that txt file and now it is just replacing that text boxes uh, value to the value of p which is equal to the value of a2 already stored in text file so that is how you can just uh, import the variable values from one dot m file to another m file by using matlab but make sure all of your files both files are placed in the same folder and you have added that path in your matlab directory otherwise this is not going to work